Hey y'all, I'm Fila, and welcome back to 7th Haven. In this video, I'll show you guys how to get the absolute best FPS for New World. Let's get into it. Now to start things off, you want to make sure that your computer is updated to the latest uh, Windows update, which is probably Windows 10. And in order to do that, you want to go left-hand side and you want to go type in check for updates. And you'll see this. And it'll bring you up to the screen and it says that we're up to date. But whenever you hit check for updates, it'll let you know that, look, everything is up to um, date, you know, your driver and everything. It's just, just generally over uh, recommended anyway. So you do want to make sure that everything's updated. And um, like, you know, even right now, we have some updates for our computer. All right, guys, the next thing you actually want to do is you want to go to the Steam launcher. You want to go to New World. This is beta at the time of this video. Right click it and go all the way down to properties. Once properties pop up, you'll see these two settings. Enable Steam overlay while in game. Turn it off. Make sure it's not clicked. Uh, use desktop game theater while Steam VR is active. Turn both of these off. You don't need these to be running while you're in game. It just lowers the FPS. Uh, the next thing you want to do is you want to go to local files, hit browse, and it'll bring up this screen. Go to new world launcher, right click it, go all the way down to properties, and go to compatibility. And you want to make sure that you disable the full screen optimizations. Um, this shouldn't be on at all, and everything else should be fine. Um, you want to actually go to change high DPI settings and when we see this you want to make sure that you use the setting to fix the scaling problems but just keep that off actually that probably is not gonna help you at all but this over at the high DPO uh, the high DPI scaling behavior make sure you turn that on and then click OK and then click OK right here now the next thing you want to do is you want to go to the actual uh, EXE uh, you gotta go down all the way down oh, I'm sorry uh, go to bin 64 Go all the way down to New World and right click it. It is a different folder. Uh, go to Properties and you pretty much just do the same thing. Go to Compatibility and you want to disable uh, full screen optimizations. And you want to go to Change High DPI Settings and you want to override this. And you want to click OK. All right, here's another setting that's going to help you out a ton. Uh, you want to go to the bottom left hand side and go to Search. Game mode, game mode settings, should be right here. And you wanna go down to game mode and make sure that this is on. Sometimes it is off, but as you can see, uh, it optimizes your PC for play. Uh, it's a simple thing, but it helps tremendously. Go ahead and exit out of that. Go back, bottom left hand side actually, and um, type in graphics settings. Go ahead and click it. And you want to make sure that the hardware accelerated GPU scheduling is turned on. Um, it quite literally improves your uh, performance. And you, you are going to need to reset your PC, but it works a ton. Just make sure. Sometimes, uh, depending on what computer that you have, you may not even have this. But if you do, make sure that it's turned on. You, you have to. Now that we did some basic GPU settings to actually help you increase your FPS, we're actually going to boot into the actual game and we're going to tweak some settings there. So go ahead and boot up New World. And once New World is booted up, there's just a few more settings that's gonna get you going and that'll be the end of this video. So you wanna go to settings. Um, you wanna go ahead and go to visuals. Now you wanna make sure that the Windows mode is in full screen. Um, there's a couple options, just make sure it is in full screen. Your resolution, uh, you can go ahead and put this as uh, the worse your resolution, the lower your resolution is the worst quality that your game's gonna be. But you can go ahead and put that in uh, low. Uh, the brightness and the contrast don't really matter, but the video quality does matter. So you want to go ahead and put that in low. I'm not gonna do it right now because it is gonna um, skip my computer. Want to go ahead and put that in low. The effect details you want to put that in low. The lighting details you do want to put that in low. The object details just put that in low. The pro uh, post processing details put that on medium actually. Uh, the shadow details, you can put that on low. The terrain details, you can put that on low. You kind of can get a little uh, trend from where we're going. The water details, you can also put that on low. 
And um, if you want to, you can go ahead and show your FPS. It'll pop up in the top right of the screen so you can see all the settings that you've been doing is actually helping you. Uh, V-Sync, I'll keep that on because it does keep the screen from stuttering and shaking. Your max FPS, you can keep this uncapped or you can cap it if you really want to. But if you really want to see the results of what you're doing, just go ahead and keep it uncapped. Um, this doesn't really matter. I'm pretty sure that's about it. Uh, that's all those things that I mentioned in the video should help you dramatically increase your FPS. And um, till next video.